Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the blur tool in Snapseed. But first I just wanted to mention, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because at 10,000 subscribers I'm going to show you my whole YouTube revenue statistics and growth strategy. Hope to make money online. So let's jump into it. First we're going to open the application. After that we need to select an image, so we're going to click on the plus icon. After that you need to select your preferred image, like so. And then at the bottom of our screen, Tools, and you're going to select Lens Blur. With this, we have three options. With the first one, we can change the type of the, of the blur, like so. With the second one, you can manually adjust it. And with the third one, you can change the shape of it, like so. We're going to select a hard one. And we are going to select the circular one with the first option. And with the second option, you can adjust it manually. You can adjust the blur strength, which will adjust the strength of the blur, like so. Transition, which will make the changes a lot more prominent, like so. And vignette strength. Here, you can add a vignette, which is the black border around the image, like so. And if you want to change the center of this blur, you can drag it around. If, if you grab the blue dot like so, you're going to point it right here. And if you want to compare it to our original photo, you can do it on the upper right corner like so. And if we are done with our image, we can either dismiss the changes with the X icon, or we can apply those changes with the check mark. Of course, we are going to apply them. And if you want to save our image, we need to click on export, which is going to show us four options. Share, which will share it to our friends. Save, which will save our image. Export will also save our image, but it will adjust the image to what we set it on in the settings menu. And export as will save our image to our preferred folder. We are going to select save, and we can view our image with the view button. I'm going to select gallery and here it is that's pretty much it for this video i hope it was helpful for you if it was please consider subscribing and see you in the next one